This vlog was made possible by Framebridge. It's Tuesday. Today is officially day 16 of my dedicated step to study time. My exam is one week and one day away. It's going to be next Wednesday. So it's getting pretty close now um, and I'm nervous about it, but I'm not trying to stress out. I take my exam seriously enough that I do everything that I plan to do, but I don't stressed about it, meaning I don't really think about it once I'm done doing all those things. So I don't ever let it get get to me and to a point where I can't sleep or I get anxious, um, but I do take it seriously so that um, I don't slack off and I do everything that I'm supposed to do. Um, I'm just gonna quickly show you guys my study plan again. I showed it last time and I got a lot of questions on how I set up my study plan. So let me show you guys. So this is my study plan. Um, basically, like I explained before, um, on the left column is a topic and the middle is all the URL questions that I'm supposed to do. I've heard that step two, um, the best way to prep for it is to do URL questions. So that's what I've been doing. And then I'm supplementing that with some book reading and then doing either Quizlet or Anki every night. Um, and that's to reinforce some of the memorization um, aspect of the studying. Okay, bye Candy. <laughs> Really the simplest way for me to explain how I set up my study plan is to make a list of everything that I need to do, whether that's questions, reading, or whatever else like flashcards, and then dividing into the number of days that I have. So if I have one week to study for an exam, I make a list of all the topics that I need to know and all the things that I need to do to master those topics, um, and then I divide into seven days. Yeah, so that's my study plan and I'm going to get ready. I'm going to go down to the library today and study there and I'm going to try to vlog my day. Breakfast. Okay, I'm headed out. Forgot to charge my camera last night, so my camera might die, but I'll try. I totally forgot that I was vlogging and <laughs> all these things happened and I just got home and I remember that I was supposed to be vlogging. So let me fill you guys in. So I left the library around 5, 5, 5.30 because I wanted to go for a run outside before it got too dark. A little update about how my studying went today. Today I was supposed to be covering psychiatry and biostatistics and to be honest, I was a little distracted. <laughs> I was a little distracted because today was also the announcement day for the new iPhone and the new um, Apple Watch. So I was watching sort of the um, announcement and the event uh, streaming online. So I think I lost like maybe like an hour there. Um, and I think I was just like excited about all these new products that I was just not as focused as I was supposed to be. Um, so I'm gonna catch up on some more work here and try to get some uh, questions done and do my um, my flashcards and just finish studying. Um, and I will catch up with you guys in a little bit. It is the next day and I'm headed out to the library now. Probably gonna do the same thing as I did yesterday, but um, I am planning on making like a midday gym break and then, um, and then I'm gonna go to the Apple store to try on some of the Apple watches because I think I'm gonna get the new one that just came out. So I wanna see which size I wanna get, the smaller or the larger one. So I'm gonna go try those on at some point midday. So, see you guys at the library. I just 
left the library. I'm gonna go to a Japanese place for a quick bite. me on Instagram story you know that I've been running outside and I think the new Apple watch can really help me with the training I may do a half marathon I haven't decided but um, so yeah that's that's what I'm considering and I'm headed back to the library now before I get too distracted We'll see you guys back at the library. my frame bridge delivery. Um, if you guys remember a couple of vlogs ago, I talked about placing an order with Framebridge. Um, they're a company that kind of custom frames anything. Um, you can either do like a digital or a physical item like a diploma or a jersey. I decided to do two digital items and they just arrived not too long ago and I'm super excited to open it and see what it looks like. So let's open this up. Here we go. Sorry, sorry Candy. So I have two of these frames here. So I'm gonna just cut these open. Oh, so excited. There's one here. And the other one is here. Cool. I'm gonna get the bubble wrap off and I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. the final products this one is the one that I took with my cell phone during my OBGYN rotation uh, it's basically showing ferning um, in under the microscope which is super cool it turned out really nice I think um, and this one is the channel banner for this design I actually asked for like a designer input of like what kind of frame and like the matting and all that and I think it turned out super cool I'm really happy with how it looks like. So cute. Candy. So you guys saw how I placed this order, but doing it on their website was super easy. You just have to upload the picture or whatever, and then you can kind of pick the frames on their website and the matting and all that. And um, it came exactly the way it showed up on the website. So the whole process was really easy. They also sent the hardware that you need to hang these frames in this cute little bot, um, bag. Um, so I definitely recommend it if you guys have something that you want to custom frame in your own apartment or your house. Um, you can go to framebridge.com and I have a discount code for you guys. You guys can use the code strike to fit 15 for 15% 15 off your first order. And I'll put all the link in um, the website in the description box below. So super excited for these frames. I can't wait to hang them up and show you guys what it looks like on the wall. Let me know what you guys think. Guys, I am going to close the vlog here and head to bed in a little bit. Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog and give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you guys think in the comment box below and I will see you guys in the next vlog. Bye!